I had concerns about the veneers that were in my mouth when I came to the practice because I had received those in my early 20s. They were kind of a, just like a quick fix because at that time I didn't have money for braces and my insurance wasn't that great. And so I thought, well, you know, these two teeth here are the ones that bother me the most. So those are the ones that we can fix with veneers. So I had that done. Um, I think they did a, a fair job at that point, but I also know that as I got older, the shade wasn't quite right. Um, I started to notice that maybe they were a little too big. Uh, and so when I came here and asked Dr. Montoya, like, hey, what do you think of these things? Dr. Montoya gave me the honest opinion and said, you know, I'd probably make them a little bit smaller. I'd probably change the shade a little bit because it doesn't quite match. And I was like, okay, that's exactly what I thought. So that's nice to hear it. Uh, so he was really honest with me from the get-go. I sort of assumed that when I came in, um, the experience to have my veneers removed would be the veneers are removed and then the teeth that are underneath that were ground down to these like little vampire things um would i would just be left with them for a week until my new veneers were ready right but the process was actually a little bit different and i was so so grateful because the veneers were removed yes but i I was given temporary veneers to put on. So I could put those on and I didn't have to worry about my smile not looking quite right because of those little teeth. And so that process, uh, going through that, not only taking care of me, but also paying attention to the fact that, you know, from a physical standpoint, that might be something that somebody wants. I mean, and I, I really appreciated that attention to detail here. How I feel about my smile is that it finally matches how I feel on the inside, which is really nice because I would smile a lot at folks, you know, before now, uh, but really I would hide parts of my mouth that I was very self-conscious about. I would make sure to do that for pictures. Uh, I went through a phase where in pictures I would not show my teeth at all. And then people started asking me what was wrong. And so I stopped doing that. But I never really felt comfortable giving like a full smile. And now I just like let those babies shine. Like I am fine with it. I feel good about it. It feels really, really nice when somebody tells me I have a beautiful smile because there's been so much work putting uh, put into getting a smile I feel confident about. So uh, I feel great about it.